What is going on today, guys? It is Step On It Gaming, and we are playing some Nuclear Throne. This is probably the most awesome indie game you guys are ever gonna play in your life. It is made by Vlambeer. You can get it for $14.99, actually, $14.99 on Steam. So it is an early access game because it is still in development. But if you'd like to watch the development of the game, you could just watch the Twitch live stream from Vlambeer himself talking about the games and what he's gonna do, which is just awesome. It really is. Just one of the most amazing games out there at the moment. Obviously, you guys can tell, you know, it's not like Cry Engine 3 graphics you have here. But you don't need that kind of graphics for this type of game, you know. So any computer can run it. Um, it actually might be coming to handheld. So it might be coming to the PS Vita and iPhone when it is released. It is still in early access, so it's not going to be out for those devices anytime soon. But I still enjoy playing this game. I just cannot stop playing it. I don't know what it is. I just like, I need to beat the game. But beating the game is super difficult. You know, for me, uh, beating the first couple levels was really hard for me. So it's it's kind of fun trying to get to see how far I can get without dying. You know, all that kind of fun stuff. So let's go. Let's do a one run right here. Just I'll show you guys how terrible I am. So I really don't get that far. And I used to get pretty far. Uh, I made it to like the fourth world. Which I think was my best. And then I died. Oh god! Here come the police. There's four of them. Hey, they never call four of them. What's going on here? Hey, this is cheating. I don't like it. Okay, there we go. I killed him. Can I leave? No? Where's where's this last guy? There he is. I want to get the chest, though. A wrench. I want to hit somebody with a wrench. They tried to shoot me as I went in the portal. What, what do they think this is, huh? I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to beat somebody with a wrench. So you can just hit people with wrenches. So there's a whole bunch of characters, you know, that each have their special abilities. Uh, like this guy, he has his awesome power, but he also has a con. I'm pretty sure almost every character has a con. I'm not 100% on that one. Uh, let me, let's go see the characters real quick. Um, so the characters, you know, these are all the characters. You got fish, and more ammo, crystal, and more HP. You know, and they, each have a, they each have a power. And then, like, closer to the end of the game, like, right before you fight the throne, you'll get, like, uh, a mega evolution, which is, like, a super mutation, and it'll give you, like, a superpower. Uh, so Rebel is also another cool character that I like to play, because it allows him to call allies. It'll take away one health, but you can call in these guys, and they're also ally rebels, and they're freaking cool. Like, if you're fighting a boss, and you just want to call in a hundred of them, because you just have a hundred health packs, you could just do that, and it'll help you out. It's pretty freaking cool, actually. And I really, I really like him as a character because he's just freaking cool. Oh, all right. And also a cool thing is the portals will heal him. So you see, I have six health and I have seven. But I wanted to thank you guys for watching this video. If you guys enjoyed it, definitely leave likes. Uh, actually, let's try to get the five likes on this video, and I'll be sh sure to post more Nuclear Throne videos. Maybe we'll post some funny ones or some walkthroughs. I don't know, whatever something that I think of. So definitely like the video. Thank you guys for watching.